for the RSI to create a higher high. And then once it creates a higher high, these are not divergent, they're convergent and you feed into the ability for you to get a rally. I don't typically look for um, bearish indicators at all when we're in a bull market as strong as what we are about to enter into. Um, it's, it's easy mode. We are entering into easy mode. What I want to caution people of is doing too much, doing too much during these periods. If you have your stack or you, you know, let's say you're in altcoins, altcoins have been doing, you know, not great. Uh, so we have some, some good numbers in the last 24 hours, but overall they've been doing terrible. Um, if you have your allocations and you're going to be adding to those allocations, have a plan for when you plan to add and then after you have those allocations, the best thing for you to do is absolutely fucking nothing. I cannot stress this enough. This is trading on easy mode. This is going to be the most furious four to six months of your life. And the more you do, the less money you will make. I guarantee it. The more you do, the more research you do, the more new coins you invest in, the more allocation and diversification and pull some profits from here and move it over into here, the more of that bullshit that you do for the next six months, the less money you will make, period. This is easy mode. You need to be ready. You need to have your plan for what you are what you are going to have allocated in your portfolio and you have to have a plan for what you're needing to look for when you are going to exit and then aside from that you do nothing nothing this is the easiest trading you will experience and the best way to capitalize it is to be exposed and do nothing i think i've drilled that point home at this point um all right let's catch up with the chat here W A Oz, man, I don't know what W A is. Western Australia. I'm not from Australia. 